All right, it is June 21st, and that means I think tomorrow is the official start of monsoon season. So you're going to be looking for things to do indoors outside of the rain. And, well, I got shows for you. So let's go. Let's bring it in. Yes, welcome to another episode of Every Show Joe Says Go, brought to you by Yucca Tap Room. So stay tuned till the end. Spotlight a couple awesome stuff, awesome shows coming through there. Of course, let's see housekeeping. If you haven't, like I said, I got the Sniper 66 shots. They're up on everyshowjoe.com, so you can check those out. Um, also, last week's episode of Skeleton Army, Concerts Consoles, that's up on the YouTube. I think it's on the Twitch history, at least for like 30 days. Uh, it's also on podcast services, so if you want to listen to the audio version, either Google, iTunes, whatever, it's up. So you can always check that out. Um, I think that's going to round up the housekeeping. We're gonna, hmm. Well, if not, hopefully it'll come to me. So, yes, let's begin tonight. It's lighter, but then it's, it's like, it with <laughs> speaking of monsoon season, it's like it withheld it for the storm tomorrow. Now that's on video, I'm in trouble. Uh, all right, anyways, let's begin. Tonight, we've got Voice Fest 2019. Uh, that's with, that's celebrating Voice, one of our bigger, big supporters of music in the punk scene, and I think metal scene, and yeah, around. He's around. You'll recognize him if you head up. And that's with Birth of Monsters, FOL, Creaseville 666, Skulldrug, Bowcat, and We Might Be Wasted over the Yucca Tap Room. But that's not the only one, and that's not the only awesome show tonight. Ah, choices. We've got Haymarket Squares, Hot House Orchids, Blood Feud Family Singers. I said it right without tongue twisting my tongue tie twist. And Ray Lydia Duo at Last Exit Live. We've got Bob Log the Third back playing Valley Bar. And I mean, that's all I have to say. That's an experience in its own. Uh, there's Rio Wiley with Bellagana's Fawn Flora. Uh, Mer March? No, Merch. Merch. I think it's Merch. I always screw this up. Sorry. Uh, and. Hevishi? H-V-S-H-I at Pub Rock Live. Plus sedated the Ramones cover band. They are at Rips tonight. So lighter options, but some quality options. Then we move on to Saturday, and I'm sorry. Even with... So get this. We had two of our local punk bands schedule an afternoon and an evening release show without actually realizing for a little bit that it was the same day and they are combining it. So even taking one show off the table, it's still a fucking loaded Saturday. And it's probably going to split up some of the punks. Because you'll, you'll, you'll see here. Let's get right into it. Oops, sorry. You're going to hear a bump on the microphone now. Uh, we got Cork. They're calling it Corky's Ape Stravaganza. So Corky's Leather Jacket, Ape, both doing releases tomorrow, Saturday. And, well, we got... Those two plus Asswipe Junkies, Birth of Monsters, ADD, Border Town Devils from Tucson, uh, Critical Myth, Shamehole, Squared, Buried in Red, Skeleton Army, uh, Happy Misstep, the 187s, and the Jenna System, all at Rips Bar, starting, I think, what is it, 1, 2 o'clock? So you can be at Rips from the afternoon all the way into the night. Just well, one place, a little bit of rock billy, mostly punk rock, right? You're already like, I think I made my choice. And then I'm going to tell you about. DRI and the Fast Plants are back. Yes. There you go. You're already like, oh, shit. Uh, with Nosebleed, God Speedball, and Narcolepsy, and Blasphemous Inebriation at Club Red. So now you've got two punk shows. You're like, hmm. Oh, God. What are we going to do? Well, let me let me add to your pains. We've got the Quakes with Tim Polcat Trio. Yes, Tim Polcat. One that I helped, well, actually, what, two, three years ago? I watched for the first time and got kind of learn more about rockabilly history and as i'm more what five years ago i started listening to but yeah like tim polcat freaking rad plus the quakes and the devillains all pub rock live and now you're like oh uh, 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 ah i don't know yet good news i got more stuff especially if your music taste is in there we've got punk night at the grid yes what you're saying there's more punk and there's not at one of these what the hell? Bass. The Deadbeat Hymns. Yes, Deadbeat Hymns. 
<laughs> a life and limb. Molotov cockroach girl blood and exit wound over at the grid Saturday night. So, all right, we got that. We got that. All right, you're, you're already like, hmm. You're going to have to be like me and start jumping around, right? But, yes, there's even more. Because I know some of this will actually kind of get into your tastes. Where are you? Kind of going out of order. There is where... Oop, yeah. We also got Remo Drive with Slow, Pulp, and Hearts of Gold over at the Nile Theater. Right? Well, at least for some of you, you're like, fuck, really? Depends your taste and of what type of punk you like, but yes. And then Taco Cat. They're here with the Paranoids, which I love how they spell it because it kind of reminds me of Domino's Annoid, the way that's spelled. Anyways, and Audrey Harper in a Valley Bar. So, what the hell? Yes, Saturday's going to be tough. Especially if you like a broader range of punk rock and some rockabilly. Alright, but yeah, then we're going to go back. I'm going to make sure I didn't skip anything. We got also Deadbeat Cousins. They're playing at Rebel Lounge with Ghost in the Willow, Full Band, Coconuts, Echo Bombs, and Gomi. So, yes, and I'm going to be there at a certain point because I'm going to be taking pictures of a band on that bill. So, yes, I will even, well, I guess you guys already know I'm going to be jumping around shows. But yeah. Really good show right there. Moving down the list, we've got No Better with Troubled Minds, Wavelengths, Negative 32 at Tobacco Row. Kid Dynamite in the Blast with the Dirty Drifters Reunion, Manic Monkeys, and Fat Gray Cat at Chopper John's. There's the Downsides, Noble Bones, and the Grim at on the list. And this one actually, for the most part, does not overlap. This one is at 1 p.m. It's a free show at 51 West. In the afternoon, so you can head to that one and then try to decide where you're going to end up for the rest of the night. Uh, <laughs> moving down, though, there's still more. Yes, Saturday is loaded, no matter what, of awesome stuff that I would love to be at everything. Uh, we got Mr. Mkinkato at Richter Aleworks in Peoria. We've got Punk Night. Pop Punk Night. There we go. A change of pace sundress. It's like love. And Palm Springs Eternal at the Van Buren. We got Carol Pacey and Honey Shakers with Sarah Robinson Band at Falkow. And we got the Moral Queers, Escape Goat, and Blue Joy at Time Out Lounge. So, Saturday, bringing in monsoon season, officially. Uh, <laughs> yes, Saturday you will have your tough choices. I think some of you already made up your mind or are already performing at one of them, so you're already locked in. Plus, you know, at 4 o'clock, we'll be streaming the concerts consoles, so you might want to set aside a little bit of time to watch that got mike from add or add 8020 80, records there we go so many 80s on this one but yeah don't worry though sunday you're really like you only have one choice that i think you should make and that's the maybe next year single release show that's with justin moody not confined and aura may and 2000 foot turtle at rebel lounge so easy right you're like after saturday whoo and then Monday, the March Divide with Ghost in the Willow, Greco Young Garden at the Rhythm Room. And, oh yeah, and we got Teak Hall and Tor, Tory Masters, Championship Edition Tour. So it looks like he's, I think he's kicking off his tour. And they're going with the Fonzarelli Project, Cases Kane, and Frescatodia at Rebel Lounge. Two of these are all one word combined together of words. It's, I, I think I did well. Right? Yeah. So Tuesday, though. Let's move right on. Some tough choices, actually. The first one's where I'm going to be at. You're going to find me at Heart Attack Man and Sincere Engineer. Yes, Sincere Engineer. Back, and I believe bringing a band this time. So if you caught her at the Lawrence Arms show, she's actually was a solo. She's playing with a, her band this time. And that's with Rom, was it Rom Hero Fox's Troubled Minds over the Rhythm Room. Yes. But also, Yucca Tap's got a killer show right here. We got Sweet Knives with the Rebel Set, Heavy Breather, and Shovel. I know. I'm supposed to make noise or something. All right. But yeah, excitement. There's Old Cross and Sore Eyes with no refills doing a combined acoustic set, if I read this right. Uh, One Way Sky, the Edisons, and the Mips over Trunk Space. So, huh, man. Plus, <laughs> all this seems so enticing to me. That's why I'm just like exclaiming in on here also we also got the vinyl voices at the coronado this is where various djs spin some of their favorite music over at the coronado enjoy some awesome food there really good stuff 
Uh, then we're going to move on to Wednesday, though. This one's light. We got Cyphered Existence with the 9... 9... 9... 9... 9... I think it's 9. It's N8 and 3. Killing Sunday, which is Creepy Don's debut with Killing Sunday. So, there you go. We might be wasting connection. Hmm. Might want to go out there for that. Uh, and the Oddity Paradox at Rebel Lounge. So, light Wednesday. Good, good. So, nothing's going to compare to this Saturday on this update. The same. Uh, Thursday, though, we've got... Gethin Jenkins with Brea Burns and the Boleros, Jim Bachman and the Day Drinkers, who are awesome. Saw them at, uh, gosh, what was that? Oh, it was the uh, Possessed by Paul James show. So really good stuff. Uh, we also got the Edisons with, seven, with two seven, yeah, two seven kilo. The Damn the Weather over Rebel Lounge. And L with Super Joint, which if you've never seen Super Joint, you need to see Super Joint. It is fucking rad. He also has a cartoon. You can go check out his Facebook and follow him and watch some of those videos. But yeah, that's the main reason that's on here. You gotta go watch Super Joint. And then Indogen over at the Rhythm Room on Thursday. So yeah. Then Friday, one of my favorite 4th of July traditions, Brolo's 10th Annual Patriotic Meltdown with the Revenge, Scorpion vs. Tarantula, Sour, 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 there we go. Uh, then Saturn 3 at Yucca Tap and free barbecue and free show. So, yes. There's the Technicolors. Yes, our local... local. Uh, blah. I'm twisting my tongue finally. There you go. Uh, a favorite local band that I found... God, it's Sail In. Freaking awesome. I don't get out to see them enough. But Technicolors with Break Shoes and Dovey at the Crescent Ballroom right there. Awesome. We got Manic Monkeys playing again with Headstrom. Uh, Ted Marengo's and the Woodworks over at Time Out Lounge. There's Dandu with House of Stairs, Terra Fractal, and Alice Sane at Last Exit. And Chris Murray is playing at the Coronado, which, yeah, some awesome, like, old school, like, ska acoustic by himself. Really good stuff right there. Plus, really good food that the Coronado has. So, yeah, that's going to be that for this week, though. Of course, like I said at the top, some awesome stuff at Yaka. The ones we're spotlighting this week. Well, first, let me tell you one other thing. You can not only can you pick up your tickets for the ones that aren't free at yuckatap.com, you can also now pick them up in person at Yuckatap or at shirts and things with no fees. So right there, good physical souvenir because I know some of you guys like that ticket set. I mean, I got a pile that you see in the opening like every week, so you know. Uh, <laughs> but yeah, so shows the spotlight for Yuckatap tonight. We got tonight. We got Voice Fest, like I said. Birth of Monsters, FOL, Creepsville, Six Six Six, Skull Drug, Bowcat, and We Might Be Wasted. Uh, there's Gethin Jenkins with Brea Burns and the Boleros, Jim Bachman, the Day Drinkers, and the Wilt family on Thursday. Ending up Brolo's 10th annual Patriotic Meltdown, my favorite tradition, uh, with the Revenge, Scorpion vs. Tarantula, Sour, and Saturn 3 on Friday, next Friday. Really rad stuff. Of course, as you see, I have a sponsor. As a small guy in the YouTubes, I don't make a lot, so you can always help me out that way. By well, doing a couple things. First off, there should be a little icon here, if not right below, if you're watching this on YouTube. And well, you can click subscribe, helps me grow, helps me grow the channel, that kind of stuff. Because eventually, if I hit some numbers, I can get ads on here. How about that? Uh, but regardless, you can also go to patreon.com forward slash every show Joe. You can support me there, even a dollar helps, helps me, helps go toward the, the gas to get to some of these shows, the ticket prices, that kind of stuff. Even the hardware, working on upgrading hardware and fixing things, that kind of stuff, improving the quality that you're already enjoying of these shows. So there is that. Um, let's see what else. Like I said, tomorrow, Concerts of Consoles should be around 4 o'clock, and that's going to be with Mike from 8020 Records. We're going to be playing... Hmm, what will we be playing? But we're going to... We'll figure that out. I'm thinking maybe Donkey Kong Country 2. Ooh. Maybe. We'll figure that out. So that's more reason to tune in. So we'll chat about the record label, about the music, how he got to start. And he's he loves video games. So that's even more awesome pairing to bring him in. So that's tomorrow, if you're watching this on Friday. And, of course, like I said, also the Sniper 66 show, the pictures and the write-up are now up on everyshowjo.com. So go check that out. Of course, keep up with me in real time. Facebook, Tumblr, kind of Twitter. I've never... Or wait. Yeah, no, Twitter is Tumblr... Is the one where I kind of the links and stop working on my phone. So, but it's kind of real time. Huh? So yeah, you can keep up with me following every show Joe on any of those platforms. Um, and I think that's it. Thank you, Tony Wiley, for the theme at the top. 
And as always, as I always tell you at the end of every episode, share the bands you like, especially those the local ones, the small ones. They will appreciate it because first they're trying to grow. They need to grow that audience. But you helping them grow means that that music you already love, they're going to produce more of it because more people are clamoring for it. They're just like, I need more of Insert Bad Day. So you go share and support them. That kind of thing. And it's reciprocated because then you'll get more awesome music, more albums out of it. And awesome. Right? All right. But yeah. So until next week, you guys be safe, but have fun and watch some awesome music.